how you all? Um, today I want to talk about layers. Everyone has layers. But I'm a man, I don't have layers, so I'm not going to talk about my layers. What I will talk about is my layers in my new spiral veggie garden. Let's see it now. Alright, so I've got one layer of uh, sticks down. Um, I got a little bit of mulch. Got a little bit of mulch there. Probably not going to be enough. Oh, I, I know it's not going to be enough. But I'm just going to put that in between the sticks. Well, I haven't decided yet, actually. I don't know if I'm going to put that mulch in between the sticks. Or whether I should put another um, layer of sticks in that, smaller sticks in through that sticks. But I might, I don't know, might use that for the next layer. See how I go. So I've just added that, um, that wood chip mulch. Give it a bit of a, I'll give it a good to soak in it actually, just to try and get it down in there. It's just, um, wood chips and layers, just a forest mulch, you'd call it, just the free stuff. Okay, so the next layer will be, gonna go grass clippings, I think. So I'll get the mower out tomorrow and do a bit of mowing. I might put a bit of, um, I might put a sprinkling of compost on it first before I put the grass clippings on and we'll um, keep adding to it. So I've just put a layer of um, charcoal, um, just about, about a handful for every sort of lineal meter around uh, and a layer of compost. Same again, it's about a shovel, about a shovel though for every lineal meter. I'll give it a good watering. Um, so next layer I'm going to put on will be grass clippings. So time to get the mower out with the catcher on, and um, yeah, get me some grass clippings. All right, so grass clippings are on. I'm just going to I'm just going to level them out a little bit, just flatten it with the. Flatten it a little bit with the steel rag as I go around. Then I'll give it a bit of water. Um, then the next level is going to be some leaves. I've got, um, I don't really have a supply of leaves at the moment, but I do have leaves like that around the place. So I'm going to get, going to get the blower out and blow them all into a pile and pick them up and see how many leaves I can, I can scrounge up. So I've got a layer of leaves in there. Probably, it's probably not as thick as I would like it in some areas, but my next level, my next layer um, is going to be some Tipawani prunings. I've got some Tipawani's down the side there I need to hack into a little bit, so I'm going to chop them up and lay them around for my next layer, and then that will help keep some of that, some of these leaves in there as well. And plus, the leaves on the Tipawani will will dry and fall off and be a leaf layer as well. Should be enough, I reckon. Don't know. If it's um, not, there's plenty more where it comes from. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just break off all the small bits. Uh, just snap them with my hand because they're pretty easy to snap than the bigger stuff. The bigger stuff that I can't snap, I'll um, just hit it with a chainsaw, just chop them up into smaller pieces and layer it all on. Alright, so this will probably do me for today. I've got a layer of um, Tipawani branches and leaves on there. Uh, I will give it a water, the sabi. And I should be right to get back into it tomorrow. Now, what I'm thinking next layer is probably going to be a layer of layer of compost. Um, then probably grass clippings. Um, but that'll be tomorrow. So I may change my mind between now and then. Um, yeah, so there we go. All right, so where, where are we? Two days ago was the last video, I think. I didn't really get too much done yesterday other than the bottle brush that was there. It's still there, um, but it was about that high. 
So I've taken the top off it, and same with the little, that Nolaluga there, we've about halved it. Um, so I'm gonna keep them. All well, the plan is to grow them kind of like a standard, I guess, and they can be shrubby at the top and clear down the bottom. Um, so this, and the reason I took the tops off them basically is because this point, this corner here, that's basically due east, and this corner here is basically due north. So that's where we're gonna especially get our winter sun through from. So yeah, we'll get a bit more sun in there. Um, now back to my layers. What I've done this morning is I've just put a put a wheelbarrow of compost around. I've put a bucket, just this bucket, a bucket of ash, a bucket of chicken manure, and just one garbage bag of shredded paper. The shredded paper was just basically put down before the manure, just to hold it in there, give it something to grab onto. Uh, so I'm going to give that a water now. Um, probably head in for lunch. After lunch, or this afternoon sometime, after my siesta, I'll probably put more grass clippings and more leaves. I feel it needs a bit more carbon, so I'm going to scrounge up some leaves. Probably put a layer of leaves down, then a layer of um, grass clippings. Alright, so that's another, another layer of leaves. I was going to do, I was going to put some grass clippings on but I've just decided just to tuck another layer of leaves on and I think that's going to do me I'm running out a bit of room I'm getting a little bit too much angle on there so everything's sort of falling off the sides if you know what I mean um, so yeah I've got um, I've got a few bags of sugar cane mulch there so I'm thinking I'm just going to cover it all up with some sugar cane mulch and water that in and let it be Well, that's it. That's my layers done. Yeah, probably not gonna do anything with this now. I'll just let it sit and give it a bit of water, at least for a few weeks. Um, I do have some, oh, I do need to put some, when I can get a hold of some more wood chips, I wanna fill the pathways up with wood chips. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, but other than that, um, yeah, let's keep the water up and we'll just see how it goes. Righto, thanks for watching, see you next time.